So we are now here in the old town. Uh, it I looks guess. like a small Christmas market, no? Yeah. Crepery. Ooh, smells actually good, to be honest. Your is awesome. Smells really delicious. Okay. Oh! That looks so nice. My goodness, this is like the old town area. takes you directly into the uh, picturesque old town before we move on mm -hmm. let's take a look at the arc this is the yeah. arc here uh -huh. uh, in more detail it is called the must telter and beer and bears the arms of king georg george one the first of mm -hmm. hanover and mm -hmm. great britain and ireland it was originally part of a horse riding arena built by the architect Trémy de la Fosse in 1714 and used to stand on the other side of the city masks. wall at the end of the Burgstrasse. We need a mask. Yeah, everyone is wearing it. But no, this girl is no, this girl is coming to not wear a mask. Yeah, because she's eating. Ah, okay. So okay. No problem. We can. We can wear a mask. Uh, this dude is not eating. He's not wearing a mask. Well, I I don't know. I think we should ha wear masks. I'm not sure. No, it's okay. So we just wear it for the safety. Yeah, exactly. Uh, timbered buildings, visible and freshly. Yeah. 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 Like yeah. Here it's a place for good beer, because I don't think in soft weather, probably in summer it would be very nice. Like yeah. You walk a lot, yeah. you, you feel hot, you want to refresh, That's so nice. you stand, take a sky, uh, ice cold beer, you pop a cold one. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, in summer it would be really great. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, all traditional things around. Small church. Okay, uh, first of all, that's 22 there, that building. Ah, that green one. Uh, Hanover's oldest family house. Oh. The red thread now wow. leads you directly to the oldest house in Hanover. It stands at the end of the Burgstrasse. Mm -hmm. You will recognize it immediately because it's hard to talk while having the mask on. <laughs> because of the many colorful art, uh, artistic decorations. The front yes. house dates back to the front, like these things, manifestations we can see. Mm -hmm. They date back to 1566. 1566. The rear part of the house is two years older. So 1566. 64. Mm. That's it. And now we have 23. This one. This church. You can look above. Exactly. It's pretty huge. Altar by Lucas Kranach or Kranach. The Kreuzkirche church. Uh, together with the uh, Edigin church, which you have already met. The one we mm. just witnessed the uh, bells. Okay. Uh, and the market church, which lies ahead of you, the Protestant Kreuzkirche or Holy Cross Church, is one of the most outstanding buildings in the city center. It was concentrated, uh, huh? concentrated. Mm -hmm. I don't know this word. Concentrated in 1333 mm -hmm. mm -hmm. as a church of Saint Spiritus e Crucis. Mm -hmm. That's probably Latin. I'm not sure. Mm, pretty old. It's yeah, it's very old. What can we see here? Here you can see this building. Uh -huh. uh, it's called the Duve Chapel. The du du Duve Chapel. Duve, yeah. Okay. Which is the south side of the Kreuzkirche, which features the Duve Chapel, which Johann Duve, an enterprising building contractor, built for himself and his family after adding the Baroque Tower to the church in 1652. Mm -hmm. The flake on the wall does not tell the whole story. Duve ran a business empire of unprecedented proportions mm. and was one of the biggest personalities in the Hanover of his day. Oh, okay. He sponsored an almshouse 
whose occupants uh, he then used <laughs> as laborers. He donated 100 thalers mm -hmm. towards the church tower destroyed. Uh, okay, towards the church tower destroyed in a storm, and earned 3,000 thalers constructing the new tower. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, the Dove, Low Germany Duvet, uh, which he donated and erected on the tower was probably one of the first examples of company logo mm -hmm. okay one of the first examples of company logo the tower <coughs> uh, company logo and outdoor advertising in hanover his vanity reached its zenith when he had himself and his wife immortalized as oh. biblical biblical oh. figures in the baroque altar which he financed of the market church so when we see the market church, probably we're gonna see his. Yes, I can see. because we're gonna see market church. This is it. Mm. Nice. Mm. Okay. 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 Now we can continue to our next location. So it looks pretty nice. Here. Like the street is so small. Yeah. And like still like this old buildings and old houses. Especially these kind of, kind of different design of the house. Yeah, we like it. Oh, so that right was here. 24. Mm. According to the map, it should be here, 25. Oh, here. Oh, this one, yes. Yes. That's Hanover's oldest gymnasium. Oh, this is without much exaggeration. The oldest gymnasium in the city. It was built between 1649 and 1664 by Duke Georg Wilhelm for festivities and badminton. A sport much enjoyed by foothills of the time. They used to like playing badminton. Yeah. But this building looks so good, see? Yeah. The green color and then all these... I don't know how do you call it in English, these plants which grows on the on the wall. That's, that's in winter. In, in summer they even look green. Oh. Like take, take pictures that would be so good, yeah. In summer it would look even nicer because everything would be green. But now yeah. in winter they are like... Yeah. Beauty season. Yeah, it's fine. That's probably the museum. This one is the museum. This one. Museum of history. Oh, okay. We now go back in the direction of the Fasada and go to the museum of history. Yeah, because it's just a picture of spies and people on top of Hi, are you enjoying Hanover? Yes, I'm enjoying it a lot. Bit cold, but the city is beautiful. Unexpectedly, the sun is out, so it is helping us a bit. But now we're gonna head for more places to see, and then probably after that, we're gonna have a nice warm cup of coffee and we will have a nice chat before we leave. Because I have to leave in the evening. Mariam and Amjad, they both are like, as I said, useless people, so they don't have work. <laughs> I have work. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'll cut this part, actually. I'm not considered an in employment, but a job seeker because I'm still a student. It's a very important thing, legally, to know. As long as you're enrolled at the university, studying your master, yeah. that's why you are considered to be job seeker and not unemployment. So you don't contribute to the unemployment rates yes. in Germany. Totally right, that's true, that's true. So what do you think about the buildings on the left? Oh, on the right side. Oh, this yeah. building, I mean, yeah, on the no, right. that's a museum. Yeah. But look at this one. This, this. No, I was talking about these ones. Oh, yeah, this one looks so good. These are some old building. In German, they call it Altbau. Oh. 47 is missing. Probably somewhere there. 
It's on that side. Yeah, over there. You can see it from here. Okay, okay that's it. Yes, yes, ah. yes. It's pretty huge. The big building you know with the pillar. On the right. On the right side. That's here, Fazan. And you go inside, and she tells you about your future. You sit there with the ball, and she looks at the ball, and she keeps telling you about your future. That that's called Valzagen. Oh, okay. I would like. To or she that. reads some cards for you. Can, with can we video it if we go inside? Yeah, of course, we'll try. Uh, I can record it so privately for you, like so that you can see later. But let's ask her if she wants. To.